Thanks for joining us. We have Fire Chief of the City of St. Albert, Everett Cook, today. He's also our Operations Section Chief within Grand Prairie Regional Emergency Partnership. Thanks for coming and helping out, Chief Cook. Oh, it's my pleasure. Glad to be of assistance. Can you tell us a little bit about the smoke that's in the region this morning? Where is it coming from? Most certainly. Uh, the smoke that the Grand Prairie region is experiencing this morning is not from the Dunes West fire. Uh, the smoke Smoke right now is a result of an inversion that's occurring across the province, pushing smoke in the air to the to the ground, and much of which is funneling to this area. Uh, I want to reiterate: this smoke is not from the Dunes West fire. Can you tell us the condition and status of the fire this morning in the Dunes West wildfire? Most certainly. Uh, so crews are continuing to work hotspots throughout the uh, fire control zone, uh, much of which is focused on the Spring Creek area. The terrain in that area is very steep. Uh, it's difficult for crews to get in on ground as well as from the air. So it's going to be uh, a long operation in that area. Further to that, uh, hotspots continue to pop up across the fire control zone. Uh, as reported in or discovered, crews are actually in the actioning them very quickly. We did uh, downgrade some of the alert yesterday. However, this is, we're hearing a critical day for operations on the ground. Can you tell us more about that? Most certainly. The Grand Prairie region will be experiencing a cold front this afternoon that will bring winds gusting up to 50 kilometers an hour. That will test the work that's been done by firefighters to date. We ask that our residents just remain a little bit more patient with us as this cold front moves through over, over the next planning cycle. So yourself, you're from the city of St. Albert here to help us. Crews from all around the province, can you just give us a little sense of where everyone's coming from to fight this fire? Most certainly. Uh, I understand prior to my coming here, the initial response uh, from outside of the area was from many municipalities, including the city of Lloydminster, Vulcan, I understand Canmore and Strathmore were here as well. Uh, further to that, we have crews from the state of Oregon in the U.S., as well as the Canadian military on scene. Of course, that is over and above the crews from both uh, or from the County of Grand Prairie Regional Fire Service. Please be sure to download the Alberta Emergency Alert app on your phone for instant notifications. As well, stay tuned to the County of Grand Prairie website, social media channels, and the City of Grand Prairie social media channels.